Hello, today we are at New Salem Bongan and we're gonna explore the Dream Beach and the Devil Tears Bay, I think it's called. Yeah. So this is the <laughs> second time we're recording this. Actually, it's the third. third. Yeah. It's the third time. So this is take three because the first time we forgot the microphone. The second time we put the microphone on, but it's all over our face. So uh, third time's the charm. That's how you say it, right? Yeah, exactly. So this will be exciting. <laughs> yeah. Now, it's really exciting to explore the Devil's Tear Bay. That's Devil Tears Bay. Yeah. yeah. Uh, at sunset. So that's kind of the main point here to see the extra beauty. Now, an important note is some people have died here at the Devil's Tears Bay and yeah. that's because the waves come crashing in really, really hard. So what we're gonna do today is not die. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and just explore the beauty and not go too close to the waves. Exactly. And these two things seem to be two of the few things to actually do here in Lambongan or to go and see because when we went to Nusa Punida there was a lot more things to like explore and more activities and more hiking and all that stuff. But both uh, Lambongan and Shenigan seems to be more like relaxed, have a good time, hang out at the beach and stuff like that. But both is nice. Yeah, so that's a really good sum uh, summary. If you want to go for adventure, go to Nusa Penida. If you want to go and chill out, go to Nusa Shenigan and Nusa Lambongan. Especially Shenigan, it was even more chill, mm -hmm. I think. Yeah. So really good chill places. Yeah, exactly. So now we're going to go ahead and explore the dream beach or the beach of our dreams <laughs> or the beach that is made... Ah, never mind. <laughs> Let's go and explore Dream Beach. Yeah, hope it's dreamy. of walking with sneakers on in sand. It's tough. Okay, some quick thoughts on this beach. It's really beautiful, but it, I don't think it's anything uh, special about it so far. Yeah. It's not like, that dreamy. Yeah, it's not that dreamy. The sand is actually, I'm sorry. I'm Thank, sorry. You. <laughs> Thank you. The sand is actually very fine. It's very nice, but uh, it's very touristy. There is unusual high amounts of tourists here compared to a lot of beaches we've seen, yeah. I think. Yeah. Um, and there's a lot of rocks in the water. And there's a nice cafe and an infinity pool behind us, which is badass. It looks beautiful. incredible. Yeah, really beautiful. It's really nice scenery. It's really beautiful, especially in this light. I think it's around five at the moment. Yeah. And it's really beautiful. Yeah. The smell is not that great though. It smells kind of fishy. Yeah, burnt fish. <laughs> kind of. Yes. Which makes sense, but it's not that Yeah, nice. it's a bit of a fishy smell. Yeah. So, overall, I think... <laughs> <laughs> Some people are going to be like, well, yeah, you went by the ocean, so of course it smells like fish. Yeah. But you know what we mean. Yeah. It smells more like fish than usual. <laughs> So I think overall it's a bit of a misnomer to call this dream beach. It's really nice, but compared to a lot of other beaches that we've seen on Bali or especially the islands, like yes, oh, Nusa Penida comparing to a lot of those, mm. I think it's a little bit underwhelming. But I think the real point of interest here is going to be the Devil's Tears Bay at mm. sunset. And the sun is starting to set already, so I'm really excited about that. Yeah, I think we should go check it out. Yeah, it's just nearby. Yeah. Uh, it's maybe five minutes walk away. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. So well, one good thing about this beach is I think the waves are safe enough to actually swim in. Yeah. Because we've seen beaches with really, really high waves and they don't seem safe. 
but in this case I think it's actually fine. Mm. They're not that high and it's, yeah, you can actually like go out a few meters in the water and you'll be okay. <laughs> yeah, it looks nice like this, it's just the rocks in the water that seems mm. not so nice. Yeah. But uh, let's go to the Devil's Tears Bay and uh, survive. Yeah, and stay safe. Yeah. That's the plan at least. <laughs> so European safety first. Yeah. <laughs> let's move. Let's move. So really beautiful day here today. Uh, the sun is starting to set. And you know, earlier when I said it's just five minutes away, well, the check Google Maps is exactly five minutes away, so I didn't lie, and I think that's super cool. Lying is really bad for you. <laughs> so we're heading towards a cliff here, and I think this might be it. It's not as final as I make it sound, but hey, let's see. Yeah? I don't know where you're going. No one we're a bit off the map. <laughs> I don't know if, if we're going this way or that way because it doesn't say on maps. We're off the grid. <laughs> <laughs> We have to stop to do a photo shoot in the middle of the uh -huh. <laughs> of the hiking. When you stop to do a photo shoot. Yep. Yep. Yay! So you can see that there's a bunch of people that have gathered there already and they're probably gonna enjoy the sunset at the uh, Devil Tears Bay just like us. No one is on the actual edge of the Devil Tears Bay, which is very sane. <laughs> yeah, because even now the waves are coming all the way up, so yeah. I think that can be intense. But we're gonna go and head over to the crowd and just enjoy the sunset. Yeah, let's join them. We found a toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like it. Well, that's a shitty situation. Mm, what you say? It really takes the piss, wouldn't you say? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't smell though. I was walking in another area before. I was like, ooh. ooh. Mm, so, what do you think? I think it's amazing. Um, I love the ocean and I love waves. I can watch them for hour for hours. So. This for me is just incredible. Like the power of the water and like the waves just smashing. It's so beautiful. Especially in this light. You should really go at sunset. It's so beautiful. What do you think? So I completely agree. It's actually one of the more beautiful places we've been to. To me it ranks up there with, uh, I think it was called Sa Southern Cliff Point. Yeah. Uh, it's that, the Southern Cliff Point and this one, the Devil's Tears Bay the most beautiful places we've been to mm. so far in my opinion so yeah they're really incredible yeah it could be that we were there at sunset both times <laughs> <laughs> okay but you never know good good point good point <laughs> so 
final words really go watch both go to the dream beach just because it's nearby not because it's impressive to be honest but it's okay yeah it's okay <laughs> you know it's probably even cooler if you're in the infinity pool up there at the hotel mm -hmm. and enjoying the view yeah and then really go to the devil's tears bay because yeah. this place is incredible and come here at sunset yeah it's really something else yeah. so you can spend the day at dream beach like having a good time have some drinks swimming whatever and then come here at sunset yeah. Highly recommended. Yeah. And we also see a lot of people like coming here with their group of friends and bring some drinks and bring some snacks and just sitting here, chilling, yeah. having a good time. A lot of people are just sitting here with a beer, so I, I yeah. think that's, that looks really cozy. Mm -hmm. So that's it. That is the Dream Beach and the Devil Tears Bay. Now, guys, if you like this, please hit the subscribe and that notification button. Like the video and let us know if there's anything we're missing out on that you think we should be visiting. Yeah, see you in the next video, guys. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.